What's up guys, it's Mr. Michael. I'm Miss Candy. We'll be taking you around the world. Pandemic edition. This, this week we'll, we'll be, be taking, taking you on a trip, trip to... Africa. Africa. Pack your bags, grab your masks. And come explore this beautiful country. Oh, didn't see you there. Hop on, put on your seatbelts, and our next stop is going to be African wildlife. As you can see, Africa is home to many, many, many animals. We have zebras, we have elephants, we have big, tall giraffes, we have hyenas. If you ever hear a hyena laugh, make sure you go to safety because they definitely do not travel alone. Uh, we have wildebeest, we have big hippos, we have big flying birds like eagles, we have plenty, plenty reptiles. We have monkeys. You always want to be on the lookout for the king of the jungle. Wait. Shh. Do you hear that? The lion! Hey guys, I missed making out here. You can see the beautiful pyramids of Giza and the Sphinx. You know, the pyramids of Giza and all this has been around for a long time. Been about just over a thousand years or so. And the two pyramids that we were able to look at the most are um, the Great Pyramid of Giza, which is about 500 feet tall, which is whew, super, super high. And then the other one was like the Pyramid of Khafre, which is about 450 feet tall, just like about 100 feet taller than the Great uh, Statue of Liberty that we have in the United States. Hey guys, you know, just had to get up close so I can show you guys a beautiful majestical creature known as the Sphinx. You know, what's crazy is uh, it has the head of a human. That's, I thought that was really fascinating. And the body of a lion. This thing's super huge. It's about 250 feet wide and 66 feet high. You know? Oh, and I also forgot that. It also has wings of a beautiful eagle. You know, and as you guys can see, you know, the nose is starting to come off. You know, because over time with erosion and stuff, water, wind, you know, things break off. So, just hopefully one day when you guys get a chance, you guys can come and visit the beautiful, majestical creature known as the Sphinx. Thanks. For, thank you guys for coming. Send you guys on your next way. Fun fact. Did you know Africa is the second largest continent on Earth? That is huge! Also, did you know about 1,500 to 2,000 languages are spoken here? I don't know about you guys, but that's a lot of languages. Woo, it's hot in here. Can you guys feel that? Did you know Africa is home of the largest and hottest desert in the world? So if you decide to come here, make sure you stay hydrated and wear your sunscreen. which they use in Africa, the word kusafiri means to journey. All right, guys, that was the end of our first trip. I hope you guys enjoyed Africa as much as me and Mr. Michael did. On next week's trip, we will be going to... Wherever the wind takes us. All right, see you guys next week. Hope you guys enjoy.